Hey, what's up? What's up? Welcome to my channel, Journey to Soul. My name is Z. What is up, everybody? I am checking in with the collective, checking in with you guys for every season. I hope all is swell. Please like, subscribe, and share if you like the message and it resonates here, okay? Um, this is a collective message, all signs included. Uh, we're just going to tap right in to see what's going down on your timeline here. What's up in your energy here, all right? Following that full moon in Libra. Um, somebody's name could be Andrea here. Okay, something about the initials B here, all right? B, Andrea, okay? Somebody could want to be you, Andrea, here, okay? So, yeah, let's tap right in. I'm going to pull an oracle here, and then we'll get straight into the tarot. Happy birthday to all my Aries babies out there. I hope you guys are enjoying your solo returns here, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay, we got Wizard of Awareness here. Okay, goblins at the bottom of the deck here coming to life. I'm hearing somebody's a psychic here. Okay. So somebody is trying to awaken your inner demons here. Okay, but with the Wizard of Awareness here, you're already, you know, aware of that here. Okay. And you know, you know what to do here. You know how to handle this here. Like um, somebody's perhaps like a Hierophant energy. You're a teacher here. Okay. Yeah. Wizard of Awareness. Like you, um, you've mastered um, some gift here or like something when it comes to protection here. Okay. Yeah. Extremes. Like you know how to weather the storm in regards to a spiritual attack here. Or like a storm. Wizard of Awareness here. Okay. You also have a lot of spiritual knowledge here. Okay. Very intuitive here. Okay. I have encouragement here. All right. Mm -hmm. So you received a lot of encouragement in the past here. All right. Possibly from your ancestors here. All right. Or your soul family here. All right. Mm -hmm. This also could be between mother and child here. All right. You could be a nurturer here for your family here. Okay. A support system for someone here. All right. Someone could need your support or your nurturing here. Okay. I'm trying to get one more here, people. Not, that's okay. All right, what do we have at the top of the deck here? We have Bone Collector here. Very interesting, okay? Bone Collector. There's a lot going on on this card here. You have a clock, you have a rabbit, um, you have a peacock feather here, and they're sitting on um, in a sacred circle here, okay? Hmm. It's definitely giving, you know, ancestral knowledge here and wisdom, okay? You could work with bones here. I'm also hearing scrying here, okay? Something about ancient wisdom here. I'm hearing artifacts, okay? As well as, what is it called? Sanskrit here, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, let's see what is going on here for... The collective realization deep freeze here. Okay. Let's get into the tarot. Mm -hmm. For Aries, a season here. Okay. So, yeah, Wizard of Awareness and Bone Collector. You have a very skilled individual here. So, we're talking about a magician here. Okay. Encouragement. Like, you could have been, somebody could have even been raised. Um, in a family of magicians, or this could just be about your bloodline here, um, your heritage, your DNA here, okay? Mm -hmm. And someone could really be supporting you here on your forward movement, on your journey here, okay? 
four of wands here with the ace of swords here. Yeah, somebody could have passed some type of test is what I'm getting here. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, rite of passage here. Okay, yeah, the queen of swords with the ace of swords. So you definitely had a good teacher here, or you are this good teacher here, okay? Yeah, I'm loving this here. When it comes to a strong foundation here, like I said, uh, mother hen energy here when it comes to nurturing, okay? okay? Eight of pentacles. So something you worked hard for is coming here, all right? This could have something to do with a strong foundation here, all right? Someone could have been trying to hold on to your work or something that you work for as well, okay? Yeah, okay? And that didn't work out so well here, all right? With the tower in reverse here, someone was trying to avoid some type of drastic change here, okay? This could have happened in the past here, or this could be currently going down on the timeline here. Something that has to do with your finances here, some wealth here, okay? Yeah, someone didn't want you to pass this test here, okay? You could have a, a hater in your energy here, in your family, just in, in the camp here, okay? Something about some type of achievement here. You know, the Ten of Pentacles is inheritance, family ties. And we also have it out here with the Four of Wands energy here. So we have this matriarch energy here, okay? You could be getting a home in the near future here, okay? With the Ten of Pentacles, this could be, um, again, property, um, family ties, inheritance, a settlement, an investment is coming towards you here. And someone was trying to avoid this um, disaster here, okay? Because you had a tyrant here, okay, in your energy, all right? Um, the tower in reverse is also imprisonment here, okay? So there's that. Well, somebody had a fear of change here, all right? They didn't want to get off the pot here. Okay, six of swords. Yeah, somebody's moving forward here. It's part of your destiny here. Um, yeah, this achievement here, okay? You could even be moving, you know, to a new location here, to a new part of the world when it comes to um, a new home here, Okay. Yeah, I feel like somebody was being reborn again with the hangman at the bottom of the deck and the star card at the top. Could have been dealing with the Pisces. Could have been dealing with an Aquarius, okay? Oh, I had the star card and the world card here. So somebody could be with the Wheel of Fortune here. Oh, so we're talking about fame and fortune here. Tenth house Capricorn energy here. Somebody could be a celebrity here. Uh, you could be an influencer here. You could have some type of um, following online here or within you know the world your community here okay and there's that magician like i said somebody is very skillful here okay i love this encouragement card here okay just so much nurturing here all right a lot of warm energy okay hmm a lot of sacral, a lot of solar plexus chakra energy here. Okay, somebody could be of African descent here. All right. Okay, so there's been some type of hang up in communication here, or somebody got paused, halted in their tracks here. Okay. Someone could be analyzing or reviewing some type of message, evidence here. Okay. I know I'm hearing benefactor. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it has a proposal here for this King of Cups energy or this person has a proposal for you here. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Someone is trying to present something to possibly get, you know, the Wheel of Fortune moving here or getting out of this stuck or stagnant position here. Okay. So we're going to have to pay something here. All right. Okay, Queen of Swords, Reverse Child. Yeah, somebody in the past. They were very cold-hearted and bitchy. Okay. Oh, wow. Mm-mm-mm. Child. Yeah, this is somebody. They could have even been accusing you of something. But see, the Ace of Swords is at the top of the deck here. Whatever this, this bitter feminine energy 
um, cruel and malicious had going on here that was trying to avoid a tower here. Okay, this person could have been telling lies here. Okay, out of bitterment, bitterment, okay, out of bitterness here, okay? The Ace of Swords is here about this person, about, you know, their character and about their true nature here, okay? Yeah, the star card. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the Ten of Wands. You know, I didn't even notice this Ten of Wands here, okay? Mm, somebody tried to put some burdens on your back here um, in secret without you knowing here. They tried to attach something to you here. There's also Ten of Wands to the Four of Wands here. Someone could be in debt when it comes to a foundation here, okay? They could be trying to hide this here. Emperor at the top of the deck here, okay? Magician at the bottom. Okay. Hmm. Ace of Pentacles here. Try to somebody try to hide a home for from you, and then it became like a burden of responsibility in regards to even like holding it down or paying the bills or taking care of it here. The Hierophant here with the Ten of Pentacles again and the Ace of Pentacles here. It's divine timing. Divine timing is at play here. Okay, in regards to whatever is being presented to you. I have the Ace of Pentacles, the Hierophant, and the Ten of Pentacles here. This is a judgment call with the Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck here. Okay. Hmm. So in current energy, destiny is currently um, in play here. Okay. No doubt about it here. All right. Someone cut their losses and walked right into abundance, prosperity here. Okay, a life of luxury here. Something is being presented to you here. All right, could be dealing with a Taurus, could be dealing with an Aquarius here. Okay, possibly once you walk away from something here, yeah, this is about a manifestation here. Okay, mm -hmm. yeah, this is something something you manifested, some type of will of fortune. I'm, some, I want to say wish fulfillment here, but damn, here's the will of fortune here. Okay, this is something you manifested here. Okay, something that you really wanted. All right, Ten of Pentacles here. Mm hmm. Yeah, you could have been dealing with some financial, um, and or material hardship in the past here. Okay. Mm hmm. And you know you stayed in prayer here. Okay. Ooh. Wow. So we have a spinner here. Okay, four of cups here. Okay, with the nine of cups. Or somebody's dissatisfied with life here. Queen of Pentacles, nine of cups. Why? Okay. Lazy, bored, set in their ways, feeling stuck, stubborn, stagnation in career here. Okay, so there's some type of stuck energy here. Um, some type of some type of lackluster energy. That could cause a situation to go either way here because there's like somebody's dissatisfied, but there's abundance all around them. This also could speak to someone who um they can't be pleased here, okay? They cannot be pleased here, okay? Let's see what's going on. Something is on the fence kind of sort of here. Mm, or somebody's unsure about something here. Could be straddling the fence here. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you had to surrender. Is what happened. You had to surrender here because see, somebody was was lying. Okay, very deceptive here. This person that was trying to avoid a disaster. Possibly this person that was trying to hold on to some type of um, foundation that belonged to you. Inheritance here. Okay. Yeah, they stole something from the family here, but you walked away with the Eight of Cups energy here, okay? You walked away. And so let's see what happened, okay? Yeah, you cut your losses. Five of Pentacles with the Eight of Cups here, okay? Mm-hmm. Someone stole something from a family here. Not just from you, but from a family. Yeah, the Will of Fortune here. You could be seeing 1010 here. So someone was out here trying to steal away your destiny here, okay? Mm -hmm. What is this here? Two of Wands here. Lack of planning, size of holding back here. Mm. 
So someone's stubborn, um, set in their ways here and is causing a blockage here, okay? Someone also could have some fear about this Ace of Pentacles, surrounding this Ace of Pentacles here, okay? You could have walked away from a King of Cups here, okay? Mm -hmm. Someone was up here still in the fortune here, okay? Hmm. Hmm. Someone did not. I said indecisive. Yeah. Okay, King of Swords here. Yeah, with the World card here. Yeah. So it's time for a judgment call to be made here. Okay. Because again, someone was very indecisive, straddling the fence here. You know, feeling very lackluster when it comes to forward movement here. It's time for you know. A successful completion here of this cycle. King of Swords with the world card. Like somebody's going to have to step into their power here. Especially when it comes to communication here. Okay. Yeah. Eight of Wands here. Somebody's getting some good news though. Okay. Something's now moving forward here. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It could be a King of Swords that's helping to bring a cycle to close here. Okay. I'm here also here in fruition, fruition here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Let's see what you need to do. Either you or somebody else, the devil card with the four cups here. Okay, yes, yeah, it's, it's the devil. It's a projection. Somebody's trying to project some stale ass energy. Yeah, with the strength card here. Yeah, okay. So needing to stand in your power here. Um, possibly reclaim your energy back to you here because someone's trying to stifle or stagnate your energy here. Yeah, with the, like they're trying to project a dark cloud over, you know, your decisions, your life here, the outcome of a situation here. Here's this lackluster energy here with the four of cups here. Yeah, and the moon card, like somebody wants you to be in, you know, this energy of depression, despair, grief here, okay? Yeah. Okay. Let's let's see how. Let's get a um spread for moving this energy forward here. Okay. Because again, I see um good news coming forth here. Okay. Someone tried to avoid a disaster, but they cannot here. Okay. Yeah. It's time for someone to reap the harvest here in regards to great fortune here. Um, let's see how we can you know stay on the up and up here. Continue to keep this energy moving forward here okay <clears throat> so dive deep here okay go with the flow as well here okay with number 34 here with these fish here okay page of wants somebody could be getting some news that they're pregnant here yeah with the two of cups energy child mm -hmm. there's a need to look closer at something as well here okay Hearing fine print, um, close details as well. The devil's in the details here. Hmm. Okay, let's see what's going on. Could be dealing with the Pisces here. Okay, this could be a masculine reaching out to you, or you could be this masculine here. Okay. Could be some subconscious, or somebody's a false person here. Yeah, somebody wants to anchor you down here. Could be this masculine here. Mm -hmm. Poverty. Oh, hell no. Yeah, I feel like this person is in poverty here and they want to keep you in poverty here. Okay? Take it how it resonates here. Okay? Someone's a false person. Also, like some subconscious healing here. Okay? With this fish here. Hmm. I'm hearing live and let live here. Okay, so releasing control. Okay? Yeah main female okay yeah mm -hmm. child somebody's ancestors here is watching over this this devil and this devilish energy here okay the gift here yep so release control here you could be the main female here so that you know your luck can come come um through here okay with this four leaf clover here okay mm-hmm yeah, release control, especially when it comes to fear here. Yeah, with this gift here. Yeah, child. 
So we have a child in the background. We have main female. Again, like I said, somebody stole something from a family. This could be from you and your kids here, all right? So just release control of the situation. And I feel like, you know, your luck will return here because it's already here with the Ace of Pentacles. You have divine intervention in regards to what's being handed um, towards you. But someone's trying to project all this yucky and dark, dark cloud energy onto you, okay? All right, collective, that has been your reading. Thanks for watching my channel, Journey to Soul. Bye.